the Greek Civil Board for the all three media best students of the country goes to. Leslie Bossel was the only editor working on the film, which involved plying through 80 hours of footage to create a 25-minute documentary. She says it felt amazing to receive recognition for the work that went into the film, especially as it was a subject that was difficult to explore. So our grad film Tease explores the new online sex world phenomena called OnlyFans which has been really changing the porn industry. Um, and we were really interested to explore um, how the lines were becoming blurred between uh, a sex worker and a social media influencer, um, because people using these platforms call themselves content creators. Um, we really wanted to look at, explore this, pro this platform thoroughly and explore what the risks were, whether it was safe. Um, but as we started filming, the first lockdown hit, which really threw a spanner in the works. Um, so at that point, we were all isolating individually in our houses, thinking, how are we going to make this film? And my director made the really bold decision to turn the camera on herself and be the subject of this film and create an OnlyFans profile. And that really enabled our film to be such an intimate and authentic um, look into this platform. Which is, which is why I think it did so well. And we are so, so, so glad that we won the Grierson Awards. I mean, to win the Grierson Awards after such a difficult um, few years making this film during the pandemic and it being a film about sex work, being such a taboo subject, it was just such an amazing feeling. Judges at the awards described it as a compelling story from the get-go with clever use of graphics and skillful editing. No doubt on a high from receiving such praise, What's next for Leslie? Going forward, I hope to start working on longer form star feature films, high end TV, and that is the area that I'm currently moving towards. I'm currently working on a Netflix feature as an assistant editor. Um, so just learning a lot and just, yeah, let's see where I get to, I guess. And from the sounds of it, we'll be hearing more from Leslie on upcoming projects in the near future.